Hey guys, it's Brandy. So today I thought I would share with you how to easily find the end of tape. This is pretty random, but hopefully it helps. I'm going to show you first with matte tape because I feel like that's the hardest one because it gets like lost. The end kind of like blends with the whole tape. So what I do with my fingers, try to find the end of it. You can always feel it. Try to, you know, go slow, don't go fast because then it's going to be harder for you to find the end. But you will always find the end. You can feel like the edge. Then I'm going to be taking some scissors, placing the sharpest part towards the tape itself like this. And then I'm going to go against the end of the tape tape like so trying to peel it off like that until I have like enough peeled off like that and once I have done that I'm gonna grab that edge and I'm just gonna be placing it towards the other edge so it kind of like creates a triangle there just so that if there is a broken edge when I peel it it doesn't like break into two parts of like tape if you know what I mean and this is what happened to me in the past when I didn't create like that triangle in the corner sometimes the tape itself has like a little cut in the middle and if you peel it off like uh, going straight away from you this happens the tape can like cut itself in half and it's harder to put those uh, edges together so the tape doesn't continue cutting in half and it's kind of like more wasteful to do this like that and then what I do to avoid uh, looking for the end again if you don't have a dispenser what you can do is fold the end like that so it's going to be taped in itself and it's going to create kind of like a label so it's easier to grab and use for next time and here i'm just showing you the same thing but with shiny tape this kind of like tapes are for the most part easier to find unless the tape is kind of like a full of designs or decorations the end kind of like gets lost in the whole thing And this is what I do when I'm just using tape. I'm done with it and I'm just going to be storing it, cut and then fold. But yeah, guys, this is the uh, tip that I wanted to share with you. Hopefully it was helpful. If it was, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out more DIYs that I have on my channel. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think of this one and share this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye.